Welcome back to episode 25 of Sega Nuts! My name's Gwanagly Blue. Welcome back on my psychic bears. Oh, we know what to do. Just gotta. Yeet! Gotta yeet it down there. Let's go ahead and keep yeeting it. And another ring! So, out of all the brains we found, we're only missing one brain. And we're not even trying to find these, by the way. These brains are worthless, Shigo. <laughs> Just like the one in your head. No, no, they're nice. They're, they're nice brains, Dr. Roboto. Really? They're too nice. They won't fight. I need killers. I need angry brains. I squeeze them. I poke them. I twist them. What do I have to do to make them fight? Maybe I should try my drill. I'm not going to bring you any more brains if you're going to be so mean to them. No matter what I do. No, no matter what. Not even if I... No, don't. Oh, not even if I no, cook no, you a little... Doctor, no. A little turtle soup. Please, Dr. Lobato, no. <laughs> a nice hot turtle soup. Mm -hmm. Nothing better on a cold night like this than some boiling hot soup. You leave Mr. Pokey up here! Oh, okay. <laughs> you sure? No! I mean, yes! <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, why don't I just go ahead and heat you up a cup? It's made of turtles. Turtles that you love. Isn't that right, Mr. Pokey Love? <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> well, maybe I'll just make some for myself. Bring me a good brain, Shigo. Or Mr. Pokey Loop becomes Mr. Smokey Loop. <laughs> Pokey Loop. <laughs> when you're a dentist, you have to learn to have a sense of humor, you know. It helps to calm the patient down. Okay, um, are there any brains here actually? One of three brains. Okay, so there's two brains for us to find in the lab of Dr. Lobo, actually. Okay, so we're missing three, four, five, six brains. So two, two, and we're missing two other ones. But that's okay. I'm still proud of us for getting as many as we did. We even have four scavenger hunt items. Again, that we were also not looking for. Uh, we are nowhere close to the Psychedet ranking. Uh, we have 10 more vaults to crack. But I feel like we're pretty close. So let's let's just go ahead and see what... Make my way to the upper ruins of the asylum. Check. Rescue Sasha and Agent Nine's brain. Oh, no. Sasha and Mia. Aha! What's this? Why, it's a nice little... Precious, juicy brain wrapped up in some sort of boy shaped gobbly gook. Well, we'll have all that excess tissue removed, and then we can slip that brain into something more comfortable. Igor! That package General Oleander mentioned has arrived. Please take it up to the holding area and keep it fresh until I'm ready to stick in my thumb and pull out a. <laughs> I tried to warn you. Listen, the man you're working for is a deranged lunatic. I know. I hate him. But if I don't do what he says, you, you... Cook your little turtle from the inside out. <laughs> she, your hostage situations like this are always extremely delicate. We'll have to extract Mr. Pokelo from his prison using my psychic powers. After which, this Lobato character should be fairly trivial to neutralize. Yes, because once we get Mr. Pokelo back, he'll tell us what to do. He always tells me what to do. Yes. Sasha, Mia, Lily, Raz, you came. 
Parasite did. We gotta get you out of here. Look! The coach must have lured Sasha and Mia here on official Psychonauts business and then ambushed them with sneezing powder. They're completely brainless. I know. I saw their brains downstairs. Listen, first things first. I was thinking about what you said about us making out. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm so glad he showed up. I was just starting to feel slightly less phlegmy. Wait, he didn't just hear. Ah! Get away from me! Stop reading my mind! Go rebrain Sasha and Mia so they can help us break this lock. I mean. Birthday cake? What is that supposed to do? I'm sure we'll figure it out eventually. Um. They really don't try to hide these brains. Don't. What can I tell you? You were right. The old legends were true. Alright, so we got all the brains in this area. Um, let me see what we can do. I get it. I think we need to do. All right, so I have three. I have three different options here. Cake. Right. That doesn't involve fire. I'm just over here being like, hmm, if we light someone on fire, they will definitely move. And they're like, yep, they sure will. They might also be dead. I'm like, no. Excuse me? Now here's what we're gonna do. The turtle actually talks. I was not expecting that. Sounds like a Rob Zombie character, I tell you what. Baby. Uh, okay. Okay, so Sasha sees... Uh, oh, that's cute, actually. Um... We don't really have anything that's close to any of that. Lily's bracelet, but I don't know if that's gonna do anything. Mm, mm. I don't think I want to put this bracelet on just yet. I think we okay. and I need to talk about our relationship first. Okay, so let's see. 
We currently have quite a bit done. Um, so it looks like that's completely closed up. So we need to go down, actually. I'm up. I hope this ride isn't too, too scary. I know, it's just a normal amount. And there's more brains. Back there is one over here. If you could stop kissing the brains, that'd be fantastic, Raz, but I feel like you're not going to. Okay, so if we've gotten this far, where are the other ones? Um Nothing can distract me from the mission. I will not rest until I've delivered the milk. You will not rest until you deliver the milk. Nothing can distract me from the mission. I will not rest until I've We don't have any milk, per se. Um Confusion, that might actually do it. Delivered the milk. Okay, let's try that again. Nothing can distract me from the mission. I will not rest until I've delivered the milk. Okay, well, I tried. Um, I'm getting really tired of being slow, so we're going to go ahead and pick up the pace. Um, we still have this area, but I don't think that there would be any brains here. We can definitely check. Not gonna hurt anything. Let me see here. The asylum courtyard. Okay, so we've already found all three brains. Okay, so we're missing three. We're missing three brains. And where are they? Bring back the brains. Brainless, brainless. Gorilla. Maybe what we need to do is we need to go around and find all the brains, then take them back to the guy, and he'll help us. That's the next logical step. I know, crazy of me to speak logically while we're in this situation. Okay, so I'm missing one brain here. No, 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 no. Okay, if I was a brain, where would I be? Um, let me see here. I'm sure it's on top of something. We have to do some weird thing in order to find it. Wait, is that it? That's it. That makes it easy. No, 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 Raz. I can't aim, can I? That'd be way too convenient. Um, I mean, we can go over here, but... What do you mean I can't go up there? What the? Okay, no idea what those are. They normally wouldn't make the brain so hard. Let's see here. There's nothing in here, unfortunately. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything, but... Wait a minute. I have a plan. It's a dangerous, dumb plan, but it's still a plan. Why is it not letting me up there? No, see, you need to let me up there, 
so I can do the thing and be awesome and save this save the city see I don't know if you know this but by stopping me you're actually contributing to the problem just in case you didn't know so now you know so uh, you wanna wanna help instead of hinder So we... Oh, I got you. Gotcha. I'm surprised Milka's brain doesn't go invisible when I get close to it. Okay, so we got that brain. What other brains do we need, actually? Okay, I know we're missing two, I just don't know where they are. Um, I'm sure they're here-ish. I can try to find out. Makes sense, actually. Um, we got that one. I'm just trying to think about what other ones we are missing. Because nothing is coming to my head. But -unts. Okay, I, I don't know what he's had, but he's definitely had enough of it. Okay, I'm thinking it's time for us to just go uh, see what all's available and start cashing in our prizes. I need to regroup back at HQ. Affirmative. Prepare for... Here's a brain. Bobby Zilch. You had a brain. <laughs> Man, I wish you were here for that joke, Bobby. Okay, we only have one more brain in order to find, and then we can thankfully end the brain kissing saga. Here we go. Dogen Pool. I told you I'd get your brain back. Okay. Okay. Now that we are back here after checking everything, we can just go ahead and use this. Go ahead and level up. We have upgraded our fire, so now we have thermal detonation. Your, your pyrokinesis power will now invoke a massive explosion around the target, setting fire to anything nearby. Awesome. We can even get a levitation upgrade. I'm gonna go ahead and turn in our mental cobwebs, get some more cards.
Okay, I didn't know we had that many. Okay, so we just need one more and we can upgrade our levitation. And what I'm thinking of doing is I'm thinking of maybe, maybe, going through and uh, redoing some of the earlier stages now that we have the mental cobwebs, duster, in order to make it a little bit easier. As well as so we can at least say that I tried. Well, the good thing about you finding that kid's brain, besides the whole thinking and feeling they'll be able to do now, is that they will be adding their subconscious mental attention to your quest, and their energy will increase your mental health potential. That sounds great. But is the surgery going to be dangerous? Nothing's dangerous when you have the right tools. Yeah. Messy, yes, but not dangerous. And then the lungfish ate me, and we became best friends. Oh, my God. I know. I mean, oh, my God. I know. Um, he's still in the, uh... Oh, never mind. So, as you can imagine, we are in some bad trouble. Sounds like it's time something bad happened to our fine coach. Well, let me tell you what our plan is. Please, you have your plan, I have mine. But, say no more. And that's how the coach is planning to take over the world. <laughs> wow, that is so not chill. Hey, where's Phoebe? We're gonna be rebraining her really soon. Well, when she comes out, she's gonna want to hit stuff. I better go wait by her drums. And so, long story short, we're hoping for the best, but preparing for the worst. Well, there's only one thing that can make this better. Pedicure. See ya! And that's why we have to find Lily right away. That is some crazy stuff, guys. I'm kinda glad I was out for most of it. Well, with the world ending and everything, I should probably go see what girls want to make out one last time. So I said, Brainer? I don't even know her. <laughs> Chris who? So, any questions? Is Elton okay? Well, he'll be fully brained soon. I promise. When he comes out, tell him I'm waiting for him down by the docks, okay? Hey, do you want to help us save the... Typical. So that's who's been kidnapping all the kids. Oh, man. I just want to burn that coach. Hey, where's Quentin? He's leading people to band practice. He better not be painting the wrong band name on my drums again. The end. Okay, here's the plan. I'm going to go get on the coach's radio and call for help. See, now that's an excellent idea. Why can't everyone be so helpful? Yeah, I modified the antenna, so now it broadcasts straight into outer space. Oh. And that's why we need your help more than anybody's. Well, shut my mouth. I better go patrol the living quarters, guard the women folk and all. Say, is my hombre walking around yet? Not yet, but soon. I just hope he forgives me for acting like such a dang fool. And that's why finding your brain in particular was my highest priority. You know, I'll bet if JT wasn't so distracted, this wouldn't have happened. He's probably with that prissy little show pony right now. No, actually, I think her mind's on other things at the moment. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll go see what's up. One of us at least should be guarding the sleeping quarters. And that is how I meet the hideous hulking lungfish of Lake Apungada. Hmm. So, does the coach, uh, does he have an evil sidekick? A yes man? Or, or a lick skittle? Anything? Not sure. Why? Uh, no reason. Bye. That's a good question. But I didn't taste it, so I don't really know the answer for sure. Well, if Brain Tank come after Mikhail, it will be sorry. Better go find Tiny Boss, see what he's planning. And so that's why, even though she is a girl, and we are good friends, she is not technically my girlfriend well i can tell you one thing my dad is never going to send me to this camp again where's k 
kitty. Never mind. I'll find her. No, I promise you. He didn't drool at all. Is Milka okay? Yeah, she's waiting for you down by the docks. Gotcha. Hey, do you want to help us save the... Okay, he's making out all anyone thinks about in this place. And so that's what happened to your brain. Wow, what an amazing story. I mean, that is a really, really good story. And you know what the best part is? I'm in it. I better go write that whole thing down before we all get killed. And that's how I earned all my merit badges. OMG! I feel so stupid for throwing myself off the roof now! What? Why'd you throw yourself off the roof? Because the poison didn't work. Listen, I have to go! The world could use some major league cheering right about now! Scared? You better believe I was scared. You'd have to be a fool not to be. But the trick is to never let them see you sweat. Wow. I guess that's what those squirrels were trying to tell me. Huh? They kept saying the tiny man is gonna kill everyone. I thought they were talking about me. Oh, man. I have to go apologize. Yes, and because you got your brain stolen and I didn't, yes, I do. I think I'm better than you. Aha! I knew it! Well, you're wrong! Have fun dying! Uh, 10 vaults and 19 emotional baggages. Everything else I don't really care about. But, that is at least the majority of it all. But, after that wonderful uh, cutscene marathon, I think we are ready to go ahead and call this an end. So I will see you all next time where we do more stuff with Psychonauts. Goodbye, my psychic bears.